this film is, and always will be, Deborah. Deborah. You're welcome. <laughs>
at one point I, as I was watching him in my notes, I put down Rithik is a much better actor than this film allows him to show. Mm -hmm. And it's not his fault or the film's fault. Yeah. It's just the film, the nature of the film. Mm -hmm. But I could see so much work. I really want to know more about Rithik. I want to know about his theater background. I want to know more about, I imagine he just does everything the same way. He just goes all in. But I could, I was very uh, interested and realized there's a lot more to this guy. Mm -hmm. Don't miss, don't make the mistake of just thinking he's a pretty faced actor. Yeah. Like, great example, Although, totally different actors like Johnny Depp. He is a pretty face. He is a pretty face. <laughs> but a lot of people made that mistake with Johnny Depp when he first came on the oh, scene. Yeah, I understand. Because he's saying. so good looking when he came out. It was like Jump Street. He doesn't seem like a Johnny Depp actor. No, no, no. I mean, but I don't know. I understand what Johnny Depp is. The his career. Yeah. Before he, he was broke a pretty out boy. The pretty boy. And then he. Stigma. Exactly. And then it was like, oh, dang, this guy's a legit actor. I felt that from Rithik in this. Yeah. This guy's I'd say, a legit I'd actor. actually say it's probably like a Heath Ledger. Because Heath Ledger yeah. was in that. Good comparison. In that uh, pigeonhole uh, that. The studios just wanted him to be the pretty boy. The pretty boy leading guy. Uh, even though he had put on great performance like Knight's Tale and yeah. um, uh, was it The Patriot yep. and, and a couple other ones in his early start of his career. But then he was like, I don't want to do that anymore. Yeah. He's like, I want to I wanna flex my yeah. flex my acting yeah, I, I, I already um, liked Rithik because of what I know about him personally and what we've seen with his dancing. And then watching his work in this, that's all. I, I was like, this guy's, this is a deep well right here. Yeah. This, this guy's a good actor. Yeah. Yep. Um, the 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 issues with the film, or, or like we said, the kind of the um, campy writing. All it was a lot towards the beginning. Just the first thirty minutes. For yeah, me. it was like that's all. Maybe maybe that was the first time they maybe they filmed this chronologically. It felt like it, um, and because they. Maybe that's just I don't know, but because like, it felt like they got their characters after a while. <laughs> I, guys, I, I had, had the same thought. I like, thought, did they film it chronologically? Yeah, like that one actor in it who was the best friend, not the one who was married, but the the other one whose father. Whose father? Yeah. Like I, I was like, I don't really like him. I didn't think he, but then he like with the father scene, which was a great scene. Yep. He he did amazing. Yeah. He did really really well, and I was like, clearly you're a good actor. And I think that might have that might have been the point. Mm -hmm. I think clearly this thing is being told, although it's really being told from the perspective of the guy getting married, mm -hmm. it's really kind of shouldering on Rithik. Mm -hmm. So our perspective of that buddy is kind of from Rithik's perspective of this guy's a, this guy is a bit of a prick. Mm -hmm. He steps in on your, and I love Rithik's character. He's, he's this go getter money dude, mm -hmm. almost Wolf of Wall Street. Mm -hmm. But when it comes to relationships with girls, he's the guy who's not going to step out. He doesn't want to, you know, he's, he's a little bit on the shy side and his buddy's like all over it. And obviously we know they had a really big problem, which I thought was beautiful. That moment, it started with the dad. Mm -hmm. When he says to his dad, what Rithik's character said to him, mm -hmm. don't say it. And also you mean it. I don't know who that actor is as the father. He's great. <laughs> he was, I, I want to know fantastic. about him. So please let us know if like, he's this like, well-known actor, because yeah. he did phenomenal. Phenomenal. I liked him. He had, he had great charisma he on screen. Totally believable. Felt like I was really in the room with these these guys, and this was really his dad. Yeah, that was, um, a, that was a great scene. And, and obviously the whole point of this film was um, about, you know, it was kind of a bromance, romance kind of, yeah. kind of thing with a little rom-com in it. Right. Um, but it was all about each of these guys kind of slowing down, Especially for Rithik, obviously. Especially for Rithik, but all of them. Enjoying life yep. for what it is. Yep. I, like, I thought right after uh, the, the, when they went scuba diving mm -hmm. and Rithik had that moment. Great moment. I was like, this is, this is good. Because that's how yeah. I feel when I'm in, in kind of like, you slow down, you go on vacation, you're on your nature, yeah. something like that. That's how you feel. Yeah. You're like, this is... But that was, a, that was one of the moments where I realized how good he is as an actor because that's a being private in public and mm -hmm. it could have been really easy to show yeah. the camera what the audience expects you to be going through. Yeah. Versus I really felt like Rithik was was having a moment of serendipitous yeah. revelation. It was believable. Yeah, and I liked all the, the arcs for you because they gave each of the characters they a, sure did. a little thing. Obviously, he had his dad thing. He had kind of slowing down, actually appreciating life and yeah. letting it come to you. And the work is not everything, um, which from what we've learned about India is, is an important part Huge. of the culture because it's Huge. A very... Go, go, go. Yeah, kind the of. expectations on you from society yeah. and having to fulfill that from society and your family. And then the other one I actually didn't see coming. I thought he was just going to be the straight man. He was like, I, he, they've kind of in love. And then uh -huh. and then you kind of saw this 
<laughs> well, that was yeah. a crazy with with what's her face, which is a, <laughs> she's always great. Yeah, she was great. I love her uh, and very different from the yeah. stuff we had seen her in. Uh, this she was more of a kind of a, a girly girl. Kind of. <laughs> yeah, but that engagement curveball. Yeah, that was crazy. Coming. I did it was not great. See it I was like, oh wait, <laughs> no, what? Don't marry her. <laughs> Don't just show your girlfriend a ring. Yeah, for one. Yeah, that was stupid. Yeah. Right off the she right said, off the bat. Should, don't just be like, hey, hey look. <laughs> be like, hey, I got a ring for my mom. Right. Yeah. You say that it first. So, but I didn't. I I felt, and this this gets me to something else I wanted to cover, is the the duo of both, and I want to make sure I give them respect for their names. So the director is Zoya Akhtar. Have we seen his other stuff? Her stuff. Oh, it's her. Yes. Great. Okay, cool. And she is the sister of Farhan Akhtar, who is the guy who's got the dad issue. They're brother and sister, and actually come from a family that's like really big in Indian cinema. Oh, okay. And was responsible not just for the direction, they were both responsible for the writing. It was a collaboration of four people, mm. and it was the two of them. And I'm very intrigued. So about is that other guy an actor, the guy with the dad issue? Is he actually an actor, or is he... He's a, everything right now. He produces, he acts, he's kind of like an Amir Khan in terms of he okay. gets his hands on a lot of different stuff. Gotcha. So he's a writer, actor, producer. He and his sister wrote this with two other people, and then she directed it, which this is the first film we've seen that we know of, that I remember, was directed by a woman, which, if you know this about Hollywood, Hollywood sucks at having women as directors. That's true. Awful. There's only been one woman to ever win an Academy Award for directing. Yeah. Because they never get nominated. Yeah. Or they don't get made. Or they just don't get work. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, and so I'm, I'm wondering if that is the same situation. I, think, I, I think imagine Mena it is all over the place. Monica was... Uh, directed by a woman? Uh, directed? I could be totally wrong. But uh, I think it was. I could be, like I said, 100% wrong. wrong. I, just, I just know... I found this out that, later. No, I believe we've seen a couple uh, a film with a, I can't don't remember what you'll let us know. Yeah. Um, but yeah, the the I I thoroughly enjoyed the film. I, did I too. thought it, like it's one of those films that it's just it's an enjoyable kind of relaxing yep. film. It yep. didn't have a like a huge like emotional curveball. Right. And so it's one of those that but it felt so good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it did. Yeah. And it did have emotion. Right. But it it it's one of those that like, if it's on like here in the states, if like you see one of those films that's on, you're just yeah. Oh, oh this would be nice. I want to watch that. Yeah, right that'd, be, now. that'd be. I feel, I feel good. I'll, I'll enjoy that. that. Yeah. Uh, and so I see why this is a lot of people's like. I post on Instagram. Please follow us on Instagram and Twitter. Uh, that we were, I, I was watching it, and people said, "Finally, it's yeah. my favorite." I got like hundreds of messages. It's but like, finally, and simultaneous, it's okay, you guys really have to watch Deborah, but then you've got to watch this and this from Rithik because these are the ones where he's really, yeah. you know, doing the awards level kind of work. And we will. And we will. But not every film, we don't think every film has to be an awards level film. No. It just means, just these, these kinds of films are really wonderful to have and watch. It's a great message. I loved the ultimatum they gave to each other as they're doing the running of the bulls. Oh, yeah. It's like, okay, if we do it, I'll publish my poetry. Mm -hmm. um, I will go and I'll find her. I didn't like that smashing tomatoes thing, I'll tell you that. I knew you wouldn't like... I, I was like, I want to be a part of that. That's a, that's. I yeah. want to go be a part of that. It feels disgusting on me. <laughs> yeah. well, you don't like it in your face. No, I don't want... Oh, I would love to go. I, the minute I saw it, I'm like, oh, Tomatoes with filth? Yeah! No. Not Get it all over you. Also, um... If it's your first time um, uh, jumping out of a plane, you can't do it by yourself. Yeah, that, that <laughs> it was a it was a maybe romanticized movie. I get it. Not only that, their first time, they're doing stuff yeah. together, holding hands in formation. I'm like, oh, okay, come on, y'all are really good for your first time. <laughs> yeah, because you have to go with somebody your first time. First, but, first three or four times. Yeah, I gave it. I, that was one of those things where I was like, I, you get a pass. That's just something I wanted to say. You get. A pass. I don't care. It's, it's, I don't either. Yeah, it's not integral. It fact. wasn't like the piano playing in Andahan. Oh my god. 